Hello everybody and welcome to the channel. In this episode we're going to be taking a look at a glamping pod that I'm staying at for the night. Now I've been diving all morning and I decided to uh, stay in a glamping pod, me and the wife and children. So we're going to see what it's like and I'm going to give you a review on it. Uh, I had a beautiful day out diving today and then we came back, we've eaten and we're in a beautiful place called Bali Castle. Now the glamping pods is, is a place called Black Nook and I'll leave it in the description. It's absolutely stunning. I'll give you a tour around it later. I've already been there and uh, put my things in there and taken a look. And I can highly recommend anybody coming to Bali Castle uh, to take a look at these glamping pods because it's pretty uh, unique and pretty good and if you do get the glamping pods this beach is just a stone throw away from it yeah these beaches are absolutely lovely why would you not want to come and spend the night here but yeah this place is called Bally Castle I highly recommend it it's absolutely stunning and it's just a stone throw away from the Black Knoll uh, glamping pods which we'll do the review on in a minute right I'll see you when we get to the glamping pods if you don't mind please hit that like share and subscribe thank you very much massive hello everybody and welcome to the black no glamping pods in Bally Castle Northern Ireland let's check them out so you'll see this sign just as you pull up on the left four star guest accommodation which is fantastic and I can understand why honestly it is superb just on your left here you have the chickens and ducks Obviously they've uh, moved the alpacas into the bigger field where the grass is longer, a bit more of a free, free roam up there. Here we have it look. When you get here, uh, you'll be designated one of the names of the pods. Like this one's Cool Kenny, and you'll pull up. Bearing in mind we've already stayed here for a night. As soon as you walk in you can smell it's nice and clean and fresh. You don't get a fusty smell at all. It's well maintained and looked after. So as you come in down to the right there's your little kitchen area with a fridge and freezer kettle toaster and if you turn right there's your shower toilet sink Really, really good. 
there's your privacy door that just slides across And as we walk around the other side, there you've got a long mirror. Hang your clothes up, there's your heating control. Everything's well laid out with instructions. And this is where you've got room for another two people. Again, there's your privacy door that slides across and just come out plenty of space here and you might be wondering where the big bed is so I'm just going to quickly show you where the double bed is you take the cushions off of the sofa if you lift it up there that's where your pillars are under there and that's where you store the cushions once you've taken them off of here but you simply just pull down on that nice and easy, it's spring loaded. And there you have your double bed. Now it's like this because we've already slept in it for a night. But when we did get here it was immaculate. No creases, the sheets were perfectly clean. And to fold it up, store it away, just simply lift it from the bottom and here presto plenty of power sockets all the way around and then simply get your cushions from back inside the sofa put them back on and there you have it there's where your yeah, double beds hidden Right, I think I've shown you everything. There's a fan. Yeah, all in all guys, it's super clean. Nothing's dirty, it's well maintained and looked after. It smells super fresh when you come here. And what can I say, all in all, I will be back, for sure I will. Would I recommend it to anybody? Absolutely, I'd recommend it to everybody. That's how good it is. Right guys, so it's evening now and the sun's setting and I just want to show you how nice these uh, luxurious glamping pods are and they're lit up superbly with the outdoor lighting just look at that and that's privacy glass so when the lights are on uh, you can't see in but you can see out and admire all the beautiful views but there we have Sophie and Mrs. Goodwin and they're just chilling out um, when you do check in you've got a nice little fire pit and some lovely furniture to sit and chill out look at all that how superb is that and there is one two three Four, there's five pods all the way down admiring them views absolutely amazing but what I'm going to do now I'm just going to run up there quickly and show you the communal area so if you're booking this place out as a family or a stag party or a hen party uh, there's plenty to do locally so 
I advise you to do this because it would be awesome. Just imagine you all camping out together and you're all in the pods next to each other. But what is fantastic about this is they've actually built a communal area where you can all gather. There's a big fire pit. I'm going to turn the camera around now. I'm going to take you to show that. And it's all lit up as well on the way there. So let's go. Let's take a look. So here we are. I'm just cutting in between two glamping pods. But look at that. How cool are they? So right, it's up this path. Let's go. And here we have it guys. You got a nice seating area here uh, with some chairs. And down here, check this out. Look at the views as well, you've got the coast there, the cliffs there, you can see the sea. You cannot beat them views. But look what they've done here. How nice is this? It's all lit up as well. So you can imagine you're all sat around here, around the wall, a few beers, bit of a sing song, fire going. And views are stunning. So, this beautiful little place is just outside Bally Castle. It's about five five minute drive and here we are at this beautiful little glamping spot we'll just turn it around there they are look now they're not your ordinary wooden thrown together glamping pods they are really luxurious I've just seen from the touring side and I can highly recommend anybody traveling to Northern Ireland or just wanting a weekend away a couple of nights away even a night away book these glamping pods yeah you're not going to be disappointed and you're also helping out a local business of course and we all like to do that but it is absolutely stunning I'll turn the camera around again. Attention to detail is really good as well. Look at this. The grounds are well kept to a high standard. As you'll see, the grass is all cut. Perfect for a get together. Stag parties would be absolutely perfect. There's plenty to do in Bally Castle. There's boat trips that go out to Rafflind Island. You can do that for one night. But look at that. Guys, I cannot recommend this place highly enough. You seriously won't be disappointed. You can feel secure as well. Because up on the shed back there, uh, there is CCTV. Of course, not invading your privacy, 
but it's looking on the routes in and out so you are safe at all times and it's immaculate the place is super clean so guys there we have it the link will be in the description along with the website hit them up please uh, leave a note saying you've seen it on the Aqua Adventure on YouTube and you'd like to make a booking the prices are awesome the place is super clean and there's lots to do and you will not be disappointed and of course if you don't mind please hit that like share and subscribe that's really appreciated and it does help this channel hope you enjoyed this one and uh, please check it out and if you want a night away weekend away look it up and book it you won't be disappointed thank you very much for watching and tuning in and i shall see you on the next one bye everybody mm -hmm.